You saved me. You've no idea what you... I didn't get... You did more than anyone else. I'm sorry, I've got no money to repay you. But I can tell you a secret. How workers like me keep up... I hope I can be of help. Kapod. Nem futhatok messze. Itt lesz valahol. Na mi van? Gyere!
not all together sure. Gertrude didn't want to say anything about that. So all we know is what we came up with ourselves. Yeah. I feel all peculiar then. The ointment is the main thing, and we'll think up some chant or two. Just let's get it over with quick. I keep hearing weird noises. When shall we three meet again? In thunder, lightning, or in rain? When the hurly burly's done? When? When? Damn it! The battle's lost and won. What's that nonsense you bubbling? I didn't make it up. It came out of me all by itself. My vision's blacking out. And I feel the earth moving. Maybe this wasn't a good idea. We're not doing it for our sake. Our intentions are pure. There's nothing to worry about. Silence. Hush now. Do you hear that? As if someone was singing. That'll be the tree roots. The earth speaks to us. Like Gertrude said. Why is it getting so dark? It's singing very loud. Make them stop. At least for a while, please. My head hurts. Don't be scared. Let it happen. Lucifer, star of the morning, we're here to ask you a boon. What is it? Do Mary pray for us. I feel the devil is coming. I'll go toward him. Show him the way to find us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now at the hour of our death. What are you praying to the Virgin Mary? You'll scare the devil away. Stop praying and speaking of death. We are here to save lives since we've lost our own. Satan, appear and send pestilence on all the humans. I'm coming to meet you. Lord of darkness, we are here. Come unto us. I hear someone coming. Who's there? Is it you, Kuta? No, I'm still over here. What's going on here? Oh, welcome, Prince of Darkness. And make yourself at home. What would you like us to do? We will fulfill your every wish. If you fulfill us. Prince of Darkness, what in God's name are you babbling about? Why are you testing us? Testing you? Jesus Christ, what have you been smearing on yourselves? A magic ointment from the herb woman? We are ready to pleasure you, Lord. In return, all we ask is that you rid us of the humans. And if you won't rid us of them, then help us get away from here. Give us riches, so we can start a new life in the city. I'll give you anything you ask. I knew it. Thank you, my lord. In return, you'll have to... Have to... Shit. I feel very weird. Oh, that ointment. You smeared the ointment on me. Fear not, my lord. Nothing will happen to you. It's all part of the ceremony. Oh, shit. What the fuck? What did you do to me? Are you quite well after your long journey? Huh? Long journey? What? From the gates of hell to here. When will you take care of the Cumans? And why don't you have horns and hooves and a goat's tail, like the priest said? Uh, 
Um, actually, I wanted something else. What's that, O oh Lord? Will you serve me and do all I tell you to? Oh, yes, our Lord of Hellfire. We'll do whatever you want. Just rid us of those wretched cumans. Which one will you take first? Me! Take me! No, me! And what about the other one? Why doesn't she speak up? Kuta, you chicken! Speak up! I want you, Hen, Hen! That was tough. Oh, but I'm all dizzy again. What is wrong with you? Is something going to come of it or not? No, I need to... to sleep. Bugger sleep! What was that? What is it? Someone coming! You're in the wrong place at the wrong, place place at the wrong, the wrong time. time. You call that combat? <laughs>
I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. I found out more about the Ujit's witchcraft. Pray, do tell. The women have got hold of some magic lotion from the herb woman, and they're using it to summon the devil. For the love of heaven. I followed them to where they held their Sabbath. They summoned the devil, danced around a fire. Oh my God, what else? The women were completely out of their minds from that ointment. Then some woodcutters stormed in. They wanted to put a stop to the witch's Sabbath. Good God. And what happened? I had to kill the woodcutters to save those women from them. For Christ's sake! How could you? Such needless slaughter! Those men meant well! Was there no other way to stop the bloodshed? The woodcutters were beside themselves with rage, baying for the women's blood. There was no reasoning with them. There must have been another way. I did everything I could. The good Lord observes your deeds. Pray for the souls of those unfortunate Christians. Pray, because you have blood on your hands. At least you see where dancing with the devil can take you. Pray for their loved ones and for your soul and mine, because we share the blame. And now please, go. Leave me alone to pray. I feel quite hungry.
Fresh bread. Come and get it. Man can't live by bread alone. You You've been working. <laughs> I heard there's a possibility. That depends on. I'd say they're. We'll soon see. Of course. The Miller isn't, but is. Well, hopefully that will. I'll be happy if. Teresa, them. Some extra pairs of. My friends. And why should I. Their experience. Well, why not? Carpenters would be helpful. Thomas, my. But they aren't idlers and drunks, are they? I'm from Scat. In the Scat's mind? Tell them. I'll give them a chance. I hope I can be a... Are there any pro... Well, there was one troublemaker around here not long ago. We dealt with him. He was selling some relics he claimed were miraculous. It was nothing but worthless trinkets. The villagers sent the bloody swindler packing so fast you couldn't see his heels for dust. All the way to Ledechko, I believe. I reckon he won't last long there either. That's all I can think of. Are there any... Nothing... Let's have a word. Well, here, my word. on your head. All right. Tell me about this dream of yours. That dream? Yes, that dream has come true. I dreamt that a young man would become my apprentice, my own pupil in the trade of miracles. Well, then I'm in luck. On the contrary, I... The lucky one. What's your name, young man? Uh, Henry. Henry. Hmm. A powerful name. So, Henry, are you ready to become my apprentice? What exactly does it entail, becoming your apprentice? 
through a lot of work and strenuous labor, knowledge of medicine, theology, and white magic. You have to study the great works of the ancients and devote your time to understanding your fellow men, listening to them, and learn to read their souls. Nothing to it. That's why God has sent you. So what do you say? First, tell me, who are you, and what do you do? Me? I am an unworthy, low, and miserable servant of Providence. Scholar or merchant, believer or heathen, I wander the world without home or family, with only my wagon offering miracles to those that need them. That's who I am. Without home or kin, I wander this world with my wagon, providing the miracles that people need. Ointments, relics, aromatic herbs, rare spices, talismans and amulets for luck. All these things I have. <laughs> All right, I'll be your apprentice. Wonderful! Oh, glorious day! I have a successor in my work. So, how do you plan to start training me? With a test of your practical skills. Oh. I have my eye on three rare objects of great value. But sadly, they're a little difficult to obtain. Go on. First. I need a tooth of St. Procopius. Then I'll need a branch from a topping out hung on a church. And finally, a talisman. For luck, I'm a passionate player. <laughs> Bloody hell, that's a lot. All right, one thing at a time. About that tooth, it's going to be slightly more complicated, isn't it? I know. Yes, it would be very difficult to gain such a rare relic, of course. That's why I have an alternative solution. I'm listening. A layman named Procopius lives by the monastery, and it just so happens, thanks to my intricate medical knowledge, that I've found out he has a sick tooth. How did you find out he has a sore tooth? Uh, as it happens, he told me at the tavern. But that's not important. And how am I supposed to get the tooth? I haven't the faintest idea. You'll have to think of something. But maybe you'll be able to persuade him to let the blacksmith pull it. Wouldn't that be swindling people? It is, and it isn't. If I sell that tooth as the tooth of St. Procopius, then it certainly is deceitful. But if I sell it as a tooth from Procopius of Sassau, then I'm cheating nobody. Does it really matter whose tooth I bring, then? Of course it does. The name Procopius in this holy land is shrouded with mystical power. Sometimes I might play a trivial trick on someone, but I assure you, I'm no swindler. Fine. I'll get it from him. Wonderful. This topping out, what's that? <laughs> You're not a carpenter, it seems. No, I'm a blacksmith. I see. Well, a topping out is a decorated spruce or a conifer tree hung on top of the roof of a new house to bring good fortune and God's blessing. And all we need to do is break off a branch somewhere, buy a few ribbons, and we've got our own homemade topping out right there. You don't understand, young man. The topping out was sanctified by a priest, and it hangs on the highest church far and wide. You can't just replace it with a decorated branch. Fair enough. That topping off is hung pretty high, isn't it? Naturally. It hangs on the rooftop according to tradition. And the church is tall. And how am I supposed to get it down? 
Damned if I know. But they had to get it up there somehow, didn't they? Very well. I'll get it. This player's talisman. Where am I supposed to find it? I actually have a specific one in mind. Here at the inn, there's a dice player who always has a cat's paw with him. That's supposed to bring him luck. A cat's paw? I thought players bring along a rabbit's paw for luck. Uh, I thought so too. But this man is winning one game after another, so cats are clearly even more powerful than rabbits. Oh. How am I supposed to get the talisman from him? I haven't a clue. <laughs> Very well. I'll get looking for... Excellent! You do that, my journeyman. Would you teach me more? Are you... I'm at your... Will you teach me how... Are you pulling... Let's have a word about... Hmm. Here you are. My word. Sakra, it's hellishly deep here. God save you. The monastery wants you to pay for treatment. That doesn't sound right. Leave it be. Uh... I won't. We... Uh, but don't get involved in Wait, who exactly... Well, he can't... Uh... In an... But couldn't there be a way to settle it? Maybe he'd let you off the... De well, don't be a twat, Fritz. The two of you are up to your necks in shit. And you're going to play tough instead of seeing sense? Go to hell, Henry. You and Elias. You're one as bad as the other. A few seconds. I want to get back. Certainly. I'd like to practice. All right. Isn't that... Agreed. I want to get better. Certainly. I'm interested in... All right. Isn't that... Agree. I want to get better. 
I'd like to hope... All right. Isn't that quite... Agreed. I want to get better at... Certainly. I want to achieve... You can't become a... Well... My God! I'd like you to teach... Certainly. I'm interested in... All right, but... Isn't that quite... Agreed. I'd like you to teach... Certainly. I'd like to hope... All right. Isn't that quite... Agreed. Now listen up. I'd like you to teach... I want to... All right, but... It... Isn't that quite... Agreed. The Miller and Lid... You really found work for us? Of course. Thanks, Henry. Uh... <sighs> The reward we took, we haven't got two groschen. Nah, that doesn't matter. That we will. Stop by and visit us in a week. We'll pay. Hope I can be of some humble service to you. The what? Your tooth. How do you know about that? As a practitioner of the healing... You're a physician. Isn't that what I said? There's a blacksmith... No, no, no. no I understand. But look here. I know about... You do that? Of course. Jesus Christ. You don't have to be embarrassed. I know, but he... Let's go then. Hey, what the hell are you doing? Jesus, it's going to be really painful, isn't it? Don't worry. It will hurt a little, but then you'll feel relieved. You'll see. If you say so.
I don't know. Isn't that a waste of time? Maybe it'll go away on its own. Are you mad? It won't go away, it'll just get worse. The sooner we get it out, the better. Yes, yes, you're right. My breath is short, my feet are sore, I buy a horse and I go. Look, I, I can't. It's embarrassing. I I'm a coward and I won't be able to handle it. We're almost there. Just be a man about it. You're right. Let's go. All right, let's do it. Hold him tight. Let's do it. It's Christ, out. The agony. They want to keep it as what a memento. I, I love it. This. Oh, all right. The sun, he 